Hi guys, so I thought I'd do a video on one of the biggest problems that face everyone. Now, this isn't, I'm not talking about things like financial difficulties or homelessness or anything like that. That's going to be saved for another video. This is more intimate, personal. Um, it's, it's along the feelings line. Now, I'm a very awkward person overall. Ask anyone, I'm super awkward to talk to. Um, in case you also can't tell in these videos, <laughs> um, and I have a crush. That's the topic of this video. People having crushes. They are a horrible thing to have because they can always be one-sided. Uh, a bit like mine at the moment, I'm currently in the friend zone. Yay! <laughs> um, I told him I liked him, and he shot me down. He said, oh, we need to talk more first, we need to get to know each other. So I've been talking to him more, and I really want to turn around and say, hey, just so you know, I do really like you, and but I'm not going to. Um, I've just been flirting more and more, but he is the type of person for things to go over his head unless you are very how do I say this very not forceful on point with your words there's another word I wanted to say but I can't remember so yeah crushes are horrible you can get very awkward around them very speechless um you can think about them so much that you can't focus on anything else all you ever do is talk about them um and you don't know how to act around them they're horrible i i like to think i'm no more awkward than i usually am but i really am more awkward um around him uh I have been getting more and more flirty without even noticing it and that's weird because my usual flirtiness is if you were a potato you'd be a hot potato. Don't laugh. <laughs> I literally said that to him once just to, just to see what he would be like. I said I was dared to but I really wasn't. Um, but yeah. They're horrible things to have because you don't know what to do and if you're an awkward person like me you just you just don't can't find the words i wrote a letter i wanted to give to him about um what i thought about him like what i liked about him but i don't know when i'm supposed to be giving that to him i wrote it with the intention of giving it to him but i don't know when I'm running out of time though because he is going to be probably moving away soon. Um, he's getting a new job and then he's going to, off to uni far away. Um, that's another thing about crushes that you ha sometimes you have a time limit to talk to them about it. And it's horrible, especially when you can't find the words. <sighs> the hor it's absolutely horrible. I don't know what to say to him. Um, my advice for anyone who has a crush, talk to them. Be confident. Um, just get it off your chest. Because I was really upset the other night. Um, I think this might also to do with my um, depression and anxiety. I was crying the other night because I wanted to, like, you know... I wanted to tell him so badly so I told him and that's when I got shot down but I felt so much better after getting off my chest I literally felt like a weight had been left lifted so you should talk to them and they may even feel the same way you never know they might just be as, as shy as you or and nervous as you don't know how to approach you um if you're as awkward as me um oh got a notification if you're as not awkward as me just take a deep breath and can't stop messaging with people <laughs> sorry I'm getting notifications now and 
just take a deep breath and count to ten and then approach them at your own pace if, if, if it helps you just start off with a funny joke or something like when I turned around and said if you're a potato you'd be a hot potato I actually have no idea what the hell that was about and yeah we're not going to speak of it ever again so that's my advice be confident I'm not and when people say oh people only go for, um guys or girls only go for confident people or thin beautiful people that's a load of bullshit to be honest <laughs> that is a load of crap and no one should ever listen to that because if someone likes you they like you for who you are not for you look what you look like and that people outside making noise and that is pathetic to, to tell people something like that no anyone can have a crush on anyone anyone can fall in love with anyone LGBT LGBT yeah the LGBT community Ugh. tripping over my words now that's proof enough anyone can love anyone you like you don't have to be a certain s stereotype or standard for society anyway that's getting off point <laughs> but that's my voice be funny be, when I, say, I don't mean be funny I mean open up with a joke if it helps you relax I'm still as nervous as ever because I'm me and I'm never gonna change <laughs> um, this has just been a load of me crap talking um, so yeah if you take one thing from it be confident take it at your own pace talk to them see what happens don't rush into anything um yeah that's it i suppose for this one bye guys